Hi, my, my name is Jin Zhang. Uh, I'm from UC San Diego. I'm one of the co-organizers for the Kisto meeting on biomolecular condensates, me mechanisms and therapeutic opportunities that's happening on September 6 to 9 at uh, Branker Ridge, uh, Colorado. As many of you know, uh, phase separation mediated biomolecular condensates uh, or this uh, condensate formation has emerged to be one of the main mechanisms for organizing biomolecular, con um, biomolecular events and biochemical activities in living systems. And uh, these condensates are uh, very complex soft matters. They regulate a whole bunch of different cellular uh, functions, and they also represent uh, very exciting translation opportunities. So this particular meeting um, is highly interdisciplinary. Uh, we're going to bring together leading scientists from broad areas of condensate research, including uh, soft matter physics, physical chemistry, cell biology, biophysics, and also leaders in bio uh, biotech and the pharmaceutical industry. And we're going to come together to uh, communicate the current status and future challenges of the field to discuss uh, potential how potential cross-disciplinary collaboration may move the field forward and also to explore uh, opportunities for targeting these condensates for translational purposes. I'm particularly interested in, um, well, actually a couple of different things. Uh, one is um, there, uh, there's a development of this sort of a soft, a soft matter physics inspired a theoretical framework for these biological condensates. And also there are very exciting discoveries of a uh, novel condensates that regulate a lot of different functions like um, vesicle trans transport, uh, cell signaling, uh, transcription and translation. So I'm interested in those fundamental discoveries. But um, perhaps the most interesting aspect is um, for, for me is to hear about this, uh, these innovative strategies for targeting these condensates for translational purposes. Yeah, I think uh, what we are trying to accomplish um, for this meeting is really to bring together thought leaders as well as fresh minds uh, from these, these different disciplines that I mentioned earlier. Um, so we're going to come together and people are going to present models, data, and maybe uh, ideas, wild ideas. Uh, and as well as we'll come together and talk about the challenges and opportunities of the field. So we're hoping uh, these interactions, discussions, and brainstorming together uh, could really motivate the cross-disciplinary collaborations to move this field forward. Yeah, we're going to basically be discussing both experimental and computational tools. Um, so really, uh, I think there's a, there's a theme. Um, we're hoping these uh, tools can help uh, connect molecular properties of these individual biomolecules at the microscopy level to their functions at uh, mesoscale cellular environments. So there's quite a bit of emphasis on how these condensates work in their native context. Really, you know, we're, we're hoping a lot of these informal discussions, interactions and brainstorming together uh, it's going to happen at the Keystone meeting. And I think the Keystone meeting format is uh, particularly helpful for this type of uh, brainstorming together or uh, informal interactions. So as you mentioned, uh, this is a tight group that's going to sort of go to the meals together, you know, every day. And there's some activities and there are uh, other sort of, in addition to the scientific sessions, there are poster sessions, there are um, panel discussion and career roundtable and other activities. So this group, group is going to hang out together uh, throughout the meeting. So we hope that encourage the interactions and discussions and um, brainstorming. And also that also especially particularly useful for the, uh, for the uh, students and the early stage uh, investigators to help them build uh, networks and to uh, encourage a collaboration.
We think this Keystone meeting will serve as a catalyst for generating new ideas and acceler accelerating discoveries in condensate research. So um, Professor Mingjie Zhang, my co-organizer, and I really look forward to having you join us uh, in Colorado this September.